The National Rental Assistance Scheme is an initiative by the government to assist citizens pay their rent. But the Ghana Real Estate Developers Association says the scheme has issues and may not be in the best interest of the people. Mr. Samuel Megaibo is the executive secretary of the association. The current law states that rent advance should not be more than six months. And we have tried to review it. I was part of the stakeholders that discussed that uh, review. And we have reviewed that it should be one year from now. However, it has not been passed. So the current law is six months in advance. So if the law is six months in, in advance, is government going to flout its own law and assist people to pay rent beyond the rent limit? I don't get it. How are they going to do it? Because you are government. You are the one who enacts the law. And you expect the citizens to abide by it. However, you are creating an office or a desk or an intervention for people to come and as, uh, be assisted to go and pay rent advance. Is it beyond your own law legal limits? Or there are plans to immediately amend the law to make it possible for people to rent in so much advance as much as they want? Mr. Megaibo fears that the scheme would have implementation challenges. Greda is of the view that the resources could be channeled into affordable housing projects. The usual bureaucracies when it comes to applications of this nature. First of all, there's a lot of deficiency or shortfall in the supply, which is the fundamental reason why there's a problem with rent in advance. If we have sufficient houses on the market, you will see that it is the landlords that will be chasing tenants to come and take over their houses. And nobody is going to ask for rent advance of so much. So why don't we channel our resources to ensure that there's adequate supply of houses on the market? And this problem will cure by itself. You don't need to put any intervention at all. It will cure by itself as so far as there are more houses on the market for people to rent or live in. It will cure the problem of uh, huge rent advance. He expressed disappointment over what he called lack of consultation with stakeholders. I remember when the first announcement came, it came as a shock to all of us. I don't remember any stakeholder engagement involving Greda to look into it, whether it is visible or not. So when we raised the issue during the budget statement, we thought that the views from the general public has gone down well with government. And so they will maybe even call for an engagement before they come out again. To my surprise, then we heard that there is going to be launch, meaning that they are bent on going forward. Meanwhile, Secretary General of the National Tenants Union of Ghana, Frederick Opoku, said the rental assistance scheme has come at the right time. Like, largely, I think it's good, um, though we expect that many people, it will be expanded for many more people to benefit, especially the informer who may be doing one or two works but cannot prove uh, pay slip and bank accounts due to are doing economically employable jobs and uh, going forward I hope government will expand it for those people to have a benefit. But for now we say it's good. It will be unfair to government, it will be unfair to the scheme managers to just have anything negative against the, the scheme because they are now rolling it up. So what I can say now is that um, I have made a word of caution when the, the day of lunch where we were invited, the National Tenant Union of Ghana signaled to government that though it is a very good initiative, it is important that they consider um, aspect where it's going to be very transparent, it's going to be fair, it's going to be credible. Some citizens shared their views about the scheme. Renting a room now is very, very difficult for people because uh, though you might have the money, but the agency people to get a room, you have to pay 10% and so on and so forth. So I can say what the government is trying to bring for uh, tenants is, is going to help them in, 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 a, in a long way. It's not easy. Life is not easy to pay a rent to. Even some of them have been... Even single room self control you can pay about 600. My brother, it's not easy. And things are very difficult. So if they said they are bringing something like that, I think is going to help. It doesn't mean a tenant is looking for a premises to stay, so it should be straight to like three year payment, two years payment and all that. It's, it's, it will be too tight for the tenant. 
we are all human beings. So it should be, if the scheme has to work, I'm praying it has to work for both the tenant and the landlord too. It's something good, but if only the, the interest on the loan or whatsoever will be moderate for each and everyone to be able to rent for. For me, it's, it's very good.